I'm back. Probably you didn't even realize that I've been inactive last two weeks. Well my PC was broken. I said that in Car's weekly update if you watched it. Anyway. Hi boys Bear Games here how's everybody doing today? Hopefully you'll good. I come back with another car to modify. It's the Ubermacht Revolter. The Ubermacht Revolter is a luxury four-door sports sedan featured in Grand Theft Auto Online as part of the Doomsday Heist update, released on January 23, 2018, during the Revolter Week event. I can't found it in any website, I think it's removed. It was available to purchase in two weeks ago, so I got it and I didn't have the chance to try it. I guess now it's time to try it. The Revolter is depicted as a large sedan with an ample cabin and various chrome details, where the front fascia features the license plate and a mesh intake with wider outer portions, as well as a trapezium mesh grille. The headlights consist of dual square-shaped units, with the inner ones working as the high beam lights, and L-shaped strips below, with the bottom one being larger. That was design-wise. Let's talk about performance. The Revolter exceeds many sports cars and even several supercars in various areas, but most significantly in its acceleration. Its immense acceleration is not only aided by a powerful engine, but also thanks to a large amount of traction, allowing it to step off the line almost instantly with no wheel spin. The car's top speed is also impressive but leaves room for improvement through upgrades. Did I mention that you can fit a machine gun on it? Well yes you can. That's why I'm going to customize it in my mobile operations center. She's looking good, but all In terms of customization it doesn't have anything special except the gun of course. Well let me try it in wall then I will find a victim. To be honest that's a powerful gun I can use it in mission or in simple preparations. Well the Ubermacht Revolter overall all it's a decent car especially for people who have more than two friend this car will be perfect. However it's not well protected as Amani tech vehicles are strong enough to use it in PvPs. Plus to that you can't get unless if Rockstar decided to make it available for a week or so. Alright guys that's all what I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed the video of today. If you did enjoy, give it a thumbs up. That will help me a lot. Subscribe for more stuff like this. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bear Games signing the video off. Peace out. Boys.